cop on the streets of Liberty City. What do you mean, Packy? I mean that my cop brother, Francis McCreary, is no longer with us. You and Jerry must be very upset. Hardly. Couldn't stand the bastard myself. That said, the only celebrating Jerry to be able to do will be in prison. He got hauled in last night. Shit, is it sick? Charges ain't gonna stick, don't worry. Anyway, it means a lot to the family if you come to Francis' funeral. It's at Suffolk today. I'll stop by, man. I'll see you there. Remember to wear a suit, Nico. We can't have you dressed like a bum in the church. It's the American dream. Yes, I want to cuddle. I want to cuddle your wife while you're going corrupt, chump. And that means you, Lefty. Okay, okay, look. Uh, this is getting out of hand. Can we get back on the topic, please? Oh, we get out of my life. Thank you so much. Hi, Nico. Hey, Kate. Oh Sorry to hear about your brother. You're, 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 you're probably the only one. He was too much of a cop for my family to accept him, and too much of a gangster to be accepted by the cops. What did you think of cops? What did you think about him? To be honest, I thought this would have happened earlier. Then again, I expect to get a call from the coroner about any one of my brothers every day. You going to be at the funeral? Sure. I'll see you there, Kate. Goodbye. Liberty. Let's do it. Thanks a lot. A daily examination. And while no one is suggesting he was an angel, none of us are. <laughs> that is why God put us on earth and not in heaven. The trials of humanity were sometimes too much for him to bear. But he was a committed family man, a man of beliefs. God asks us to show faith, and that is what he did in his way. Francis gave so much of himself and will be sorely missed by us all. Amen. 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 Now, if you will all please join me in the procession to the cemetery. <laughs> Francis was a good boy. I'm uh, sorry for your loss. I'm not. I'm sorry for Ma. I gave up on my brothers a long time ago. Most I ever expected from them was to put flowers on their coffins. Hmm. You have a strange family. Who doesn't? I don't know. Oh my god, get the hell out of the way! Frankie's plot is in the graveyard on Colony Island, Nico. Can we put him in the ground? Ah! Damn it, with some back doors light, Nico. The fucking casket better not fall out. Go easy. You should have backed off a long time ago. Taste of blood? In 800 yards, turn left. You ain't no fucking match for me. I think we finally lost him. Shit, I never thought I'd be on the run from some Albanian gangsters with a cop in the car. Can we call for backup or something? Are you suggesting that I'm a fucking cop? I thought that you would know better than that. No, you dumb European fuck. I met my brother, Francis. It was a joke. Hell of a fucking time to be making jokes about your dead brother. You know, 
I'm still not that fond of the guy, even in his death. I guess that's what cop will do to a fraternal relationship. I guess you've got enough brothers to hate one of them. Swiftly running out, Nico. Ain't got that many left. Now that Francis is on his way to the graveyard and Gerald is behind bars, all I got left is that smack hit. Okay, this is it. We can put him in the ground now. Thanks, Nico. What for? Guys like you don't like cops. Being here, helping us out, I appreciate it. It's not that I don't like cops. You do what you do to get by. Cops are just regular guys trying to survive. Anyway, I'm not here for Francis. I'm here for you and Packy. Like I said, thanks. Give me a call sometime, Nico.